Hey, love bugs, it's Roslyn back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed and doing blessed and highly favored and definitely, definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my growing extended beautiful family, just thank you for reaching out. Just keep doing the things that you're doing, learning more about yourself, becoming more towards your true self, your higher self, and which is also a beautiful blessing. So with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light. And many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already, please, what are you waiting for? Like and subscribe. You can hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And if you feel like you are comfortable enough, please go ahead and drop me a line or two. I love to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me, even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video, or you're just up telling me about your impact again and how it impacted your life and sending you towards a positive direction. Or if you feel like the video has been very informative to you and gave you good vibes that you would love to share with a loved one or a friend, please go ahead and do so. And while you're at it, give me a thumbs up, like, and even share on your social media favorites. And thank you so much once again for stopping by my channel and showing love and support and I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video and the meditation music that I'm listening to today is called free yourself from evil eye purify and cleanse yourself very powerful against negative forces you know you get that when people be looking at you like a death will kill like if they can blow you up with your looks you know people do that I didn't know people can actually put a hex on you just by looking at you funny so be careful with that. But that actually goes good on what I was about to say on my content of my video. And it's Twin Flame 101. Hey Oka's. Uh, hey Oka's, are you trying to control the rage? <laughs> are you trying to control the rage? You know, we can be the most funniest people. We are the ones that, you know, that want to take the load off want to you know not treat it have you know treat life so serious you know what i'm saying even though we can be serious at times but then there are some times when they touch that point oh my goodness and i knew i was about to start saying talk about something because my eyebrows start itching my nose start itching <laughs> you know what i'm talking about but it's just like you going through stuff you tired of seeing injustice around you you get tired of people just acting the way they do you might you know, you might be living, having a roommate that you can't deal with, or you have a spouse that, you know, just working your last nerve. You might have a friend that is just, you can't do nothing with them, and you just try to pray for them, but things just keep getting worse and worse. Or you just, you know, you deal with that co-worker that keeps snitching all the dad on time. You can't, if it ain't interfering with their job, it still don't matter because they snitching, because they don't have nothing else better to do. Y'all know what I'm talking about, them rages. Because it's just like, there are some times I have to put myself in a happy spot. <laughs> I have to put myself in a happy spot. And, I mean, it just basically picture myself on the beach. <laughs> so, just picture myself on the beach somewhere. I'm like, you know, you're trying to get to a parking spot. Somebody done jumped in your way and you know you're ready to get out your daggone car. Because they seen you were trying to get to that spot and they were like, no, I seen it first. I'm going to get to it. Even though you had that right away. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Control it. <laughs> control it control that rage you know even though when stuff go down you have to try to start sometimes instead of going out there beating the holy heck out of somebody preaching heaven and beating the hell out of them you know you gotta find something very comical find something happy think about something like you know like somebody rubbing jelly on themselves because you think that's kind of gross but hey yo get your mind off and want to slap somebody they'll save you some money from getting bailed out a jail I've been there, you know, I've been to places where I've had people, when they found out who I was, who I truly was and who I was related to, and they messed with my money and took my check, and people were like, girl, I would have went up there, I said, see, 
I said, when, when, even though I got mad about that, when Spirit God told me to let it go, I'm like, let it go. I need my money. I worked hard for it. And them folks that harassed me, you know, they put me through hell the last two weeks of my, my job. And I forgot what special day it was in August. It, it's like the 21st or the 31st. It was like the new moon day, but I quit on that day. It was the day that everything was supposed to go crazy. And I made sure I did it on that day. So just because they were making me mad, but they took my money. It was just like two works, two uh, two weeks worth of work, and it was supposed to be time and a half, and that was a lot of money. And my friend was like, "Rosalind, you need to come up to this job." I said, "Girl, I'm telling you, if I come up to that job, I'm not just gonna come up to that job. I'm gonna come up to that job and flip that job over with y'all in it." I'm not coming up there because I know somebody is expecting me to come up there and somebody then they're already going to be prepared for what they, they, no, uh-uh, you ain't about to catch me like that so they'll have something to talk about later. I made sure, even though I was sour about that for a good minute, it, you know, I had to look at it like, you know, if you would have went up to that job and acted a plum fool or went postal, they would have got you put in jail and then they would have laughed about you. So I had to let that go. There's times that, you know, people will do something that intentionally piss you off just to get a rise out of you. You got to walk off sometimes. <laughs> Control that rage. Control that rage. Don't, you know, don't be a Tyler Perry 1-800 smack that. Don't do it. Don't do it. <laughs> don't do it. Do not do it. I'm telling y'all because there's days, I mean... I, I'm talking to people and they're laughing at me because I'm just like you could be you, you could be dealing with somebody in your life and you, you know you can look at them and just like you know I've been in in in, in you know situations where you just like oh gosh can you just stop just existing can <laughs> you just stop breathing and you know you try not to be like that because empaths are very sweet but when you cross us oh Jesus God. Watch out. Watch out for whoever does that. Watch out because we can bring so much joy to your life, but we can wreak a lot of havoc in it too. <laughs> wreak a lot of havoc in it. And it's just like there's times, I mean, I can sit up here and laugh about it because I know I've put myself in situations that now I can sit back and laugh at it because it's like, oh, Jesus. But then there's times you have to you know, consider yourself blessed. Because there's a lot of times I know you probably wanted to knock the holy heck out of somebody. And you did that woo moment. Like, orange is not the new black for you. You have to tell yourself, orange is not the new black for you. Orange is not the new black for you. You know, just because they get, you know, how they do it on, you know, on these shows don't mean you're going to get away with it too. <laughs> don't try it. Just don't try it. But just go ahead and center yourself align yourself put yourself in a happy place <laughs> put yourself in a happy place try to you know put yourself in a situation and make yourself laugh think about something that'll really just make you bust out laughing i have to do that sometimes when i'm mad and people think i'm crazy but that's all right they'll let make make them think you know what let's leave her alone because nobody sits up here and gets that mad and starts busting out laughing after that because if they do you may not want to mess with them. And that's, you know, sometimes that me, you need that approach for you just, ah! <laughs> you know, do something like that. Just for them to leave you alone and maybe they'll, you know, it'll stop and it'll control that rage. So I hope you were able to resonate with the content of my video. Sorry, y'all. You, you know, sometimes I'll come at y'all crazy with stuff <laughs> about things like that because we do go through rages. We seriously do. Because sometimes you got to laugh to keep from crying. And y'all know what I'm talking about. So, you know, when you go through that and you feel that rage coming, try to put yourself in a really funny situation so it'll keep yourself from saving you from going to jail or, you know, getting your butt beat up or just doing something that you'll really regret later. So, like I said, I hope you were able to resonate with the content of my video. Send out as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can. And know that you are blessed and highly favored and truly loved. And know there's always somebody out there, you know, praying for your better days. And sending out the most utmost beautiful abundance your way. Uplifting vibes, healing vibes, and loving vibes if you truly need it. And know, know that you, oh my goodness, I'm about to mess that up. Like and subscribe, even hit that notification bell. You know, drop me a line. I'll love a chance to hear from you. 
and give me a thumbs up like and even share on your social media favorites y'all this is like my eighth video so sorry if i start getting silly that's the reason why because i'm probably getting delirious so i will see you on my next video stay blessed stay prosperous and know that blessings are actually coming your way peace and be wild